Well, tomorrow is the birthday of a famous and infamous Butte writer who balked at social norms at a time when most women did not do that. MTN's John Amy enlightens us. Mary McLean was not the typical woman of the early 20th century. She went to New York and was one of the first women reporters for the New York world. Um, she was a, a silent film star. She lived in Chicago and shocked people in Chicago as well. Born in Canada in 1881, McLean moved to Butte when she was very young, living in this home on Excelsior Street, where she would write her provocative book, The Story of Mary McLean. The book was extremely controversial and made her famous and infamous. She talked a lot about sex, which was not a topic that was ever discussed at that time. Um, the library um, board met five or six times about whether to ban her book and didn't ultimately ban the book. As a journalist, she reported on the mistreatment of the poor and immigrants and the environment. She raised uh, social issues to a point that people did have to start paying attention to them. Butte actor Rob Cox remembers being a part of a play in Butte about 10 years ago about the life of McLean. She was uh, very interesting. She actually seemed like the kind of person that I would have hung out with. <laughs> you know, she, uh, she defied all of the social norms. Mary McLean certainly was provocative in her writing, but there was more to her than just being controversial and saying things that good girls shouldn't. She spoke about the women should have the right to work and the right to be paid equitably. And Mary really pushed the envelope on every social moray of the time that she lived in. McLean died alone and broke in Chicago in 1929. She would be 140 years old on May 1st. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News.